Then at the end of your first season at Dundee, it's not long until uh, Claudio leaves the club along with Avano and uh, Dario. How did you feel at the time when Avano and Dario had to leave? Uh, I think in this moment when Dario, he tried to do to the best for the team, you know, uh, the club, I don't know what happened, uh, but the uh, I think it's when Dario very good moment in the club. Uh, I don't know what happened, but uh, I, uh, he tried the best for the team. But uh, when the quads go, no, it's problem. Yeah, I don't know what happened. But uh, I think Dario and Dario very good team coach. Yeah, so were you very <laughs> sad then to see them leave? I, I don't know. I don't know what, what happened when go. Oh, so you're, you're not sure of the, the details. So what, with, with Dario and Avano, you said they're good coaches. What made them different to the other coaches you've had in your career? In Dundee? At Dundee, yeah. Oh, I think... Uh, uh, I don't forget the... <laughs> Jim. Jim, the very good coach. Jim Duffy, yeah. Duffy, G. Duffy. I think Jim Duffy um, uh, very good time while he played the, the final the the, the champion, the cup at bottom. So as a coach with Jim and Avano, what made them different coaches? Anything in particular you really liked? Uh, I think uh, different different tactic player that the coach. Why Dario try to uh, play the same Italian football and uh, Jean uh, play very strong. You know? But I I think uh, very good with Jean Duffy. Now we look into Jim Duffy. When Jim is the manager of the club, as you mentioned, there's that run to the Scottish Cup final. Uh, what are your memories then? If we if we were to just kind of analyse that run to the final, uh, you scored yourself in the quarter final against Falkirk at, uh, at Dens Park, or it was called Dens Park at the time. And that sealed Dundee's place in the semi-final. Do you remember having a, a great buzz about the place that you've just qualified to go to Hamden? The semi-final. The semi-final, going to Glasgow in the, the very big Hampton Stadium. Yeah, 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 no. And this day, when play the semi-final, very good, you know. Uh, uh, win 1-0 one, one with goal the Georgie. Uh, I think uh, the, the, the people, the Dundee, are very, very good. Too much people go to the, the match. No, very happy this day. And what was your memories of the fans that day showing up in Glasgow at the stadium, appearing in their numbers? Very big crowd. Yeah, no. Yeah. I think look at a big stadium, too much people down there. I, I'm very happy yeah. in this uh, semi final. I, you know, uh, after the match, uh, come back to win it 1 1 0. I'm very happy. and when come in the bus, uh, look at the people, uh, very happy, you know, I, I, I'm very happy in this day. And then when we go into the final, do you remember what Jim Duffy said to you and the team before you played against Rangers? Oh, I, uh, Jim Duffy, I think uh, in this match, uh, play the same, the same match the other time, you know. Uh, I think in this this match with the uh, Randy, the the team play very good, but uh, no score goal. But uh, uh, 
pero va de los one zero, pero va de I, I think that the play uh, the, the better with Ranger. Yeah. So why do you think then, was it just a problem of not being able to score? Was that the only obstacle in our way to, to beat Rangers and win the cup? Yes, maybe not score the goal for us. Uh, I remember Barry Smith shoot the after the line, post, uh, post the uh, this. This I remember the the Barry when shoot peg uh, peg in the post. In the post, yeah, and. Before before you play the final, do you feel excited? Do you do you feel that you're going in with a chance to win the trophy, or are you feeling a bit nervous that it's a very big, very big game? Mm, I think you know, and this year uh, I play with Ranger. This year, yeah, I scored two goals. After that, I very. 100% confident uh, win the, the, this match, but uh, um, I don't know. I, I think uh, win this match, but the uh, lost one zero, no, not too much, you know. But uh, I'm happy, I'm very happy uh, with the team to play in this final. But the uh, Ranger not playing not too much. It was very, very close margins, of course, and uh, yeah. you'll you'll be familiar with uh, the in the current Dundee team, the captain Charlie Adam. Uh, you played alongside him in the Julian Spironi's testimonial, formerly of of Stoke City and, and Liverpool. Um, he was he was actually in the crowd that day as a Dundee fan, uh, rooting on you to to win. Um, alongside, there's, there's a photograph that we've got here. Um, not sure if you've seen this photograph before. I, th I think you may have. Ah, yes, I did. Do you reckon? Do you know who, yeah, you know who the the boy in the white shirt is. The the white. Craig Whiten. And he scored the, the the goal to go down down the ninety. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. No, I, I, I look at the goal the the crime when the score. Goal. With Dandy Knight going down. Were you very happy that day? Yes, <laughs> very happy. Very yeah. happy. Yeah. So, do you take a bit of pride then that you see players like Charlie Adam and Craig White and once upon a time they were fans of yourself before they became football players? Yeah, yeah I played with the Adams in, in Testimonio <laughs> Julian. Uh, I'm very happy why he played in, in England. Uh, as, after he tell me, Fabian and you, I, I find you. <laughs> and Darren tell me him. I'm very happy why you know he played in England and I stay the fan the dandy. I'm very happy for me. So speaking of the uh, that derby there. How did you enjoy the Dundee derbies on a personal note? And the derby? Yeah, yeah, yeah I, I, and this, this day for me, uh, very important, you know, uh, why I try to win every, every derby. I remember one scored two, two goal. After one, one Sara scored three goal with Dundee 90. Uh, very happy they went went play with and and win. I think maybe never lost when I play with Dundee United. Yeah, I think you had a very solid record in the derbies. And how how did the, the that derby? How did that compare to other rival matches you've had in your career? No, for me very very good. You know. Uh, and this day, the, the people too much, and the, the people in the the road and and the the pitch. I mean, 
many people standing. I'm very happy when when win, you know. Mm-hmm. For me, it's very important the people want to stay happy. So now when we go into the 2003, there was a dark, a very uh, sad time coming up and you had to end up leaving the club because of uh, financial issues, issues with the club's, the club's money. Um, so you had a, a, a career break and you come back in 2004. What was, what was that time in between like for you then, leaving Dundee before uh, coming, ba- uh, coming back to the club? Yeah, yeah this, this time uh, for me, no good, but uh, you know, to leave the Dundee, you know, uh, the team very good. Ravanelli come back, Ravanelli, too much good people, good player, but uh, the problem, the economic, uh, difficult time. But then this time, my, 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 Marit, yeah, uh, born, my, my daughter was born in Dandy this year, February. I stay in Dandy to, to wait for my, my daughter born. But a difficult, difficult time. No, 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 like. Yeah, uh, this year when I come back, i very happy, uh, you know, uh, I try to the best for the team, but uh, this year, the, you know, had too much young player this year. But, uh, you know, uh, come back to Dundee, uh, for me, for, uh, very happy. And it was another um, short spell because you, en- you end up leaving the club uh, for the last time, uh, unfortunately, after the club succumbed to uh, relegation. Um, was this was this worse than leaving the first time for you? Go down. Yeah. See, yeah, the full time yeah, go down. Uh, I think in this moment maybe the team too much players, young player in this year. Uh, I think this is the problem one when go down this year. So, but I maybe on the money, I the same problem. The second time is more difficult. Why well, you know, uh, leaving and go down, no, no good for for me and, and the team. So, yeah, you know, I love I love down the FSA. And, I don't like to go down uh, this time, but uh, some different time. But uh, I don't go, no, no like to go down in this year. But you're obviously still very passionate about uh, Dundee FC. Um, I think it's, it's it's very clear. Of course, you come back to play with uh, Sproni's testimonial. You've you came back recently to the city to play in a, a charity match. Um, do you have you always did you always follow the results after you left to see how the team were doing? Yes, I go in in Instagram and in, in Facebook. I look at the result of the Dandy. Uh, I think I don't I I don't see on, only look the the goal score and the the, the match the the. the after the, the comeback to Paraguay. When I, when I look at the, the match, uh, yeah, I'm very happy when we win, uh, but sometimes low lose, not happy, but i I very fun the Dundee FC. I love the, the club. Maybe one time I come back to, to, to coach, I won. Mm-hmm. Now I receive, I received in Paraguay to coach, uh, I won have the speed to maybe one, two years after try to to come back to to to, to Dundee. So when you